So this is uh, number three uh, and we've got a fluid here. Uh, we can tell that in a way because it's not only oral uh, but it's a syrup as shown here. Uh, and I'm already looking across and I see a TDS and that means to me tricycle or three times a day. Okay, so let's see what we've got. Uh, now, what do they want is 500 milligrams. There's our 500 and the question is saying here you're supplied with erythromycin 250 milligrams so that gives us our 250 but in this case it's actually in mixed in with five mils of uh, of fluid in this case syrup so excuse my blotch there um, I tend to put five over one in other words just to remind me at the end of it that there's something to multiply on the bottom and something to multiply on the top the other way of looking at this and setting it out or as, a, or as an aid memoir I'm going to go straight across my sheet of paper and pull out a, a different colour pen. Another way of looking at this, this is that the patient wants that, you have that, uh, and it's in this fluid. You could use this aid memoir, uh, N for need, uh, and have, that's what I have, and this is the solution, or if you like, NHS. So, NHS, need have solution. It's just a way of uh, remembering it. So now we need to do some cancelling down. Uh, we uh, can take our noughts off here, or don't forget, divide by 10. You might see that 25 goes into 50 straight away. That's a good way of doing it. How many 25s are there? How many 25s are there? Uh, two. Don't forget to multiply the top of the fraction, which gives us 10. Multiply the bottom, which gives us 1, and 1 into 10 uh, is 10. That's very satisfactory so far, isn't it? Um, and the frequency of this is 3 times, so we've got to give this amount uh, 3 times. So the total amount you'd be giving uh, would be 10 mils times 3. So in all, over the day, it does say each day, uh, it would be 30 mils would be the answer. And then don't forget to put the mils in, the units in, every time the units.